Welcome to the Beverly Hillbillies Facts and Trivia. Appreciate you being here. Ask you to please subscribe. Please, please, please subscribe. And when you do, hit that little bell down there. It'll notify you when I put out new uh, videos. Uh, please share these on your Facebook page with your friends. Maybe we can get some viewers that way. Um, and once again, I do have an Andy Griffith Show Facts and Trivia channel if you want to look that up. Uh, that's quite popular, actually. Uh, this one's taking a little longer to take off, but we're going to make it take off. So today's uh, edition is on uh, Hee Hall host Roy Clark. He uh, recalls about his first ever on-screen kiss, and it was with Donna Douglas of the Beverly Hillbillies. So let's get right to it. Roy Clark called his casting as the Clampett's cousin Roy on the Beverly Hillbillies a sort of natural thing. He said the creator of the show, Paul Hanning, called his agent uh, with Clark in mind the moment they wrote the character. He remembered Hanning told his agent, we've written some scripts, so we'd like to have Roy come in and do it. Now, this was back in 1968, more than a year before Hee Haw would premiere and transform Roy Clark into a country singer. Uh, who Jimmy Dean debuted on The Tonight Show when he guest host in 1963 to a popular and charming country music and sketch comedy variety program host. He Hall would keep Clark on TV for nearly three decades, enjoying regularly airing syndication beyond its initial run, and ended in 1971, but as its host, Clark didn't really see himself as an actor. That's why he found the invitation to join the Beverly Hillbillies cast on their show as a recurring character a little daunting. In an interview, he said, although they were playing hillbilly parts, they were great actors. Irene Ryan, Buddy Epson, and I guess was one of the first things that Donna Douglas did and one of the first meaningful things that Max Bayer had done. He didn't know if he could hold up the scene with these seasoned actors. That didn't keep him from trying, and in his first acting role on TV, Clark claimed in the interview he even got his first on-screen kiss, saying, Donna Douglas was my first TV kiss, then adding, that ain't bad. You can watch this magical moment for the Hee Haw host yourself in the video, which you can find on YouTube, uh, which also features uh, him performing a sweet rendition, rendition of the little old log cabin in the lane. Before he strums his guitar, he tells Jed, Granny, and Ellie that it's a song he wrote just after he left the cabin behind, connecting the hit sitcom to the old song, Bluegrass Song. Um, in his long career, Clark took on a handful of acting roles, but it all started with these appearances on the Beverly Hillbillies. With the role Clark described as such, I thought the character on the show was a combination of me from Hee Haw and what they wanted me to portray. There wasn't much of a difference there. And that's all I got for you. I really enjoyed Roy Clark on the Beverly Hillbillies. Um, I cannot find a video of the one he did where Jethro was managing him and had him all dressed up in his weird get up and he was making all these weird noises with him and playing it. It's so funny. Um, if you if you guys found it, well, let me know. I'd like to see it. Uh, have a great day. Don't forget to subscribe. Please subscribe. And uh, please share these out. And um, don't forget the trivia question on the Facebook page. God bless. Have a great day. We'll be praying for you. Mm -hmm.